Hello everyone, I'm Pacific Casual Gamer. Welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be telling you guys how to make a better bard class in Oblivion. Now, there is a bard class in Oblivion, but anyone who's ever played Oblivion knows that the pre-made classes all suck. All 100% of them just completely suck. So today, we're going to talk about the bard class and how to make it better. And to start, we got to talk about the main things, which is the burst sign, the specialization and the attributes. And really for attributes, it's a bit interesting. You need personality and agility. And I'll get to the personality thing in a moment. Then for your sign, you basically just pick the thief. Mainly it's for the agility, but also luck is kind of nice when it comes to this class. And you're gonna have a stealth specialization because you're using a lot of stealth skills in this class. For your skills, you're gonna have speechcraft, merchantile, sneak, illusion, blade, alchemy, and marksman. Now, basically, how you're going to combine all these skills is, the way I like to look at it is this, and that is, bards and assassins are very similar. An assassin hides in the shadows, while bards are completely out in the open and no one suspects them. So, let's say you find a really rich person, right, and you want their stuff. The way that you would uh, deal with it is very simple. You go up to them and you make friends with them, right? Then what happens is you sneak behind them, stab them, and then when they go to fight you, you just yield. They're like, oh, whatever, and then you kill them. You're kind of like that friend who's like a jerk, but everyone likes you anyways, but you end up killing everyone. So then you get to just take all this stuff and steal it and... Sneak is basically so you can get offenses in the Thieves Guild, really. That's all it is. And when it comes to this class, the reason why you want alchemy is for the poisons. Because poisons offer great combat bonuses. If you can make like something like damage health or drain agility or paralyze. Paralyze is really good for this class. But really, Illusion is there to make them your friend. Merchantile is there to sell their stuff. And Marksman is there in case you want to use a bow. Really... All you need for this class, um, in essence, is the speechcraft element, sneak, and blade. Those are the main ones that you really want to focus on when you're using this class. And I'm, I, I, you know, I think speechcraft in Oblivion is underused because it's so. Instead of like fighting someone, stopping, starting combat, it's better to just kill them. Like everyone knows that. So that's really how you make a better bard. Generally speaking. Um, in Oblivion, all the social skills really are crappy in this game. I mean, Illusion's good for, like, invisibility or paralyzes. That's kind of what it's good for. Everything else is eh when it comes to Illusion. Speechcraft, worst skill in the game. And it's just not a good class. Now, there's also Sneak and Blade and Marksman on this class because then that allows you to raid caves if you need better gear, but I don't know. There's just not a lot of social manipulation you can do in Oblivion. But anyways, with that, that's it for this class build, guys. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more videos on Oblivion. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I will see you in the next episode, stream, or vlog of whatever I decide to make.